Good morning, East Round Post Central School District students and staff. My name is Terry Marcel, and I am a retired educator who is an advocate for all of you because I believe with a good education, you can and you will achieve your goals. It is my honor to share with you information on a woman who cared about our school district and who showed her commitment by securing a position on our Board of Education for 36 years. Mrs. Georgine Hyde was born in Prague, Czechoslovakia. She spent two years in a Nazi concentration camp where her parents and her sister didn't survive. She also lived in Australia and England before coming to the United States. Mrs. Hyde said, and I quote, it's the obligation of the survivors not to dwell on the past, but to keep the historical significance of the Holocaust alive and make positive contribution to the future. Mrs. Hyde did this by speaking to students and giving public lectures about the Holocaust throughout the Hudson Valley. She was a co-founder of the Rockland Center for Holocaust Studies. She also served as co-chair of the Rockland County Commission on the Holocaust and was a member of the New York State Holocaust Memorial Commission. In addition, Mrs. Hyde served as president of the New York State School Boards Association and Rockland County BOCES Board of Education. Many government leaders in New York State valued her advice on public education. Mrs. Hyde was well educated. She earned an honorary Doctor of Humanities from Dominican College in Blaubelt and an honorary Doctor of Humane Letters from St. Thomas Aquinas College in Spark Hill. She also received the New York State School Board Association's Everett R. Dreyer Award for Distinguished Service. In addition to the above, Mrs. Hyde was an active school board member. She spoke out as an advocate of the students. Mrs. Hyde was the first elected to the Board of Education of the East Round Post Central School District in 1969. She was re-elected 12 consecutive three-year terms. She was instrumental in establishing standards for basic ethical values to be stressed in public education in East Ramapo and throughout the state. In conclusion, our school community is very lucky to have had Mrs. Hyde supporting us over the many years that she served on our Board of Education. Mrs. Hyde passed away in 2015, but she will always be remembered as someone who cared about our school district and our students. Thank you. Questions, let's see if you can answer these. How many years did Mrs. Georgine Hyde serve on our Board of Education? Two. How many terms did Mrs. Hyde serve on our Board of Education? Three. What can you take away from this presentation about Mrs. Georgine Hyde? Thank you again for paying attention to this presentation and enjoy Women's History Month.